make a film about a man that sounded lonely And all I gotta do is act naturally Ooh, hey there friends, Eric Andres, your guitar sage here to teach you how to play Act Naturally by the Beatles or Buck Owens. I think Buck, o Buck Owens might have been the first guy to do it. I don't know, I'm sure you'll tell me here on YouTube. That's what we do. We tell people stuff. Um, so um, here we go. It's a really simple song, super fun to play. Uh, Buck Owens, if you don't know, was from Hee Haw, but obviously before that he was a country and western star. Um, look him up online. Really cool guy, um, cool player, musician. I don't know what kind of guy he was, um, and a great guitar player. He used to watch him a lot as a kid on Hee Haw here in Nashville. Okay, so here we go. We're gonna play this. This song basically has a G, a D7. You don't have to play a D7, you can play a D. Okay, you could play a D. And it has a C in it, and it has an A7. And there's one place in the song where the D7 would sound better, but if you play a D, it's okay. It's not very prominent which means that um, it's just not very loud. It's not very domineering in, in, the, uh, in the song. So you'll see some interpretations with a D there and some with a D7, um, but you could play either, okay? Real quick, a little bit of theory, because I gotta go into it about it, is if you're playing a D, basically a D7 is a D, is a D major chord, but it's got one other ingredient in it. That's why sometimes you can use chords interchangeably because one chord works fine. It may not have all the detail that you want, but there's nothing about that specific chord that has a bad note in it, okay? Uh, with the seventh chord, it's basically a D major chord, has a little bit more information in it, a flatted seventh, okay? So, uh, the strum, this is basically like one, two, three, and four, and one, two, three, and four, and one, two, three, and four, and if you don't know how to strum and all that good stuff, hit the link below and go to the Unstoppable Guitar System. I'll show you how to do, how to strum, how to do a bunch of stuff, okay? So check that out. Um, okay, the chords, are, I told you the chords, very simple chords. You should know these already. These are simple open chords that you should know. If you don't, go to, the, go to yourguitarsage.com, get the free ebook, link is also below, and um, start playing these open chords. They're in every song ever since the history of the guitar, okay? So, you got the strum. So the chords are gonna go like this. Uh, and there's really two parts. I'm looking at my notes. There's basically a verse and a chorus. So the verse is like uh, G. Gonna put me in the movies. Oh, let's, sorry. Let's go backwards. Let's talk about the intro of the song. Okay, so there's a little lick there if you wanna know how to do that. We're basically doing a walk down. We're walking down the scale. Four, three, two, one. If we were in G, but we're actually in the key of G. We're actually, just scratch what I just said. If we were in the key of D, that'd be four, three, two, one. But we're actually in the key of G for this song. Okay, so it's frets. Well, I'm on the fourth string and it's five, four, two, Zero, five, four, two, zero. And you can hit a D7 there, or a D. Now I bring my thumb over the top here and I mute the two low strings. I do that so I don't get this sound. I get a nice D chord sound. If you wanna know more about that, here on YouTube, type in your guitar sage, thumb muting. And I'll show you some really cool techniques, okay? All right, so there's that. G. And here, that's just a hammer on the fifth string from zero to two. And then on the fourth string, you pick the second and pull off to the zero. Easy enough. I'm doing that with the first finger. Get it? Okay. If not, it sounds nice going. Well, it's a 
can just go right into it. You don't have to do that lick. So, chords for the verse are G. They're gonna put me in the C. G. D7 or D. G. C. D7. All I gotta do is act natural. G. Pre, middle, what, what, what are we gonna call that? A pre chorus? Well, I bet, well, I, well, I bet, don't make me a big star. Some form of a D, a D or D7. You can never G. Movies are gonna make me a big star, G. A7, cause I can play the part so well. D7 there, sounds real nice. So play the D7 there. So A7. Part so well. Okay. You're gonna put me in the movies. And then we have the ending, which is basically the same. G put me in the C. G D G C. All I gotta do is act now. Yeah, right? That's it. Easy, my friends. I told you, right? Hey, hit thumbs up if you like this and subscribe. Get the ebook. Wash behind your ears. Go to the Unstoppable Guitar System. Link is below. Eat your veggies. Be kind to animals. Spay and neuter. Practice your guitar. Don't trust the man. That's it for today. That's it. Hit me up on Facebook, Twitter, and all that good stuff if you, if you like to chat it up. If you want to know about guitars and Instagram, if you want to see all my lovelies. Just got this one. Lita Ford owned that one from the Runaways. Huh, right? Nice. All right, that's it. I'll see you, my friends. I'll see you.